Good afternoon guys. I hope to be heading out to my winter camp very soon and I just wanted to make this short video showing some of the supplies I'll be bringing out to my camp and the sled I'll be hauling it on. I figured it would be easier to haul everything in one shot rather than make multiple trips. I have here just a regular plastic toboggan that I modified. I attached a piece of plywood onto the back and bolted it on using carriage bolts. I also have these tie-off points that I made so I have multiple areas to tie down my load. And on the bottom here I have a single aluminum runner going down the middle and this will help stabilize my sled especially when I'm going down hills. And what I like to do is lay down a tarp over top of the sled first. This one I have is about six by eight feet and then wrap up all the contents so they don't get lost. So I got my tarp laid out on top of my sled. I'm going to start putting my items on. I try to put all the flat stuff on the bottom if I can. So I have here my swivel arm pot stand. This is going to be a big help out of camp. Make cooking so much easier. So I'm just going to put this piece here on the bottom. I have my four foot crosscut saw, probably my second most important tool at my camp. And I also have some fireplace tools here as well, poker, uh, scoop, brush. Some of this stuff was just going to be thrown away anyway, so I figured I might as well bring it up to my camp. I have here a part from a freestanding hammock. This is something that was going to get thrown away. I figured I'd take it out to my camp. It'll add some extra strength and comfort to my existing bed. And I also have a roll of cordage as well. You can never have too much cordage at camp and it's just rolled up to make it more compact. I have an ammo can filled with uh, dry goods, spices, hot sauce, uh, olive oil for seasoning, my uh, cast iron pans and for cooking. So this is going to go on the front. This is one of my cast iron pans I'm going to be bringing out with me. I found this during the summer. And I also have a cast iron pot. This will be great for my clay oven. This handle unscrews so you can put this whole piece right in the oven. I have a large stainless steel pot. This will be used for, you know, if I get a chicken or a rabbit. A nice big cooking pot. And finally, I'm going to bring out this book by my favorite author, Peter C. Newman. Uh, this is for when I do overnighters or if I get stranded out at camp. You know, some days I go out there and it's pretty nasty weather, so I get stuck in my shelter. So I'm going to put all this on and then tie down my sled. Tell you trying to work with tarps in the wind makes you want to rip your hair out. But I have this very long piece of cord attached. And I'm just going to start weaving it around those tie downs. Now that I have it all tied down, going right to the back, I'm going to start up at the front and start making sure everything's really snug.
Now that it's all nice and tight, I'm going to work my way back to the front. So that is a very good secure load. I feel confident that that's going to make it to winter camp in one piece. You know, there's tons of hills, valleys, deadfall to go over. It's not going to be a fun trip. So the next time you see this sled, it should be getting pulled to my winter camp. <laughs> 